What's up, everybody? I think I know who leaked the email between Pete Hegseth and his mom to the New York Times. Let's get it. At this time, you're on TV explaining yes. your son and his character. Yes. Because somebody gave the New York Times that, uh, that they email. Did. They How did. How many people got your email? Was it just to Pete? Um, you know, I, I haven't been able to track that, like, like my blind copy or my copy. Um, you know, I, I haven't been able to track that, like, like my blind copy or my copy. Yeah, guys, that was very important. Let's replay it. Um, you know, I, I haven't been able to track that, like, like my blind copy or my copy. Um, I don't think that's important right now. I think what's really important is that the truth uh, be told about that email and that we look at Pete today, not then. Right, for all you guys that are unaware of this, uh, Pete Hegseth has been chosen by President Trump to be the head of the Department of Defense. And basically what has happened is, uh, you know, when this stuff happens, you get picked for some of these um, higher up governmental jobs, you know, with a lot of power. They really start going through your entire life looking for everything they possibly can to bring it against someone. In the midst of this email scandal, basically, uh, Pete Hegseth cheated on his wife and, you know, it ended up you know, ruining his marriage. And in the heat of all of that, in the midst of all of that, Pete Hegseth's mom wrote him an email, you know, saying these, all these things about how he should treat women better. Um, he shouldn't be, you know, out there, you no know, tomcatting around, all that kind of stuff. And basically someone leaked that email to uh, the New York Times. If you notice, Pete's mom looks in the camera and says this, um, you know, I, I haven't been able to track that, like, like my blind copy or my copy. All right, guys, this leads me to a, an idea or my own personal conclusion to this, considering the information we have that once Pete's mom wrote him this email, she probably CC'd it to his ex-wife to let her know that she thought Pete was wrong by cheating on her. And therefore, she cc'd her in a moment of emotion, a moment of high, just, you know, stress. And, you know, she was probably thinking about, you know, she always wants to see her grandkids in the future and things like that. So what that tells me is she probably more than likely sent it to Pete's ex-wife at the time was his wife, but the mother of his kids you know, to let her know that she agreed with her about Pete's uh, cheating. Guys, Pete's mom knows it was Pete's ex-wife that sent it there, but she loves her grandkids, but she's also going to take up for her son. Therefore, she did not oust Pete's ex-wife, who was also, uh, you know, birthed her grandchildren. So, but hey, man, you guys have a blessed day. Who do you think? Who do you think? was the culprit, man. You guys be safe.